Well, it's not a coincidence that such an important company, and certainly a global company, has uh, such a large presence here in New Hampshire. I mean, you know, uh, uh, the company that used to be Sanders, which is now approaching 60 years old, uh, has flourished and is going to flourish in the future, I'm sure. But the reason for that is that uh, certainly the people. Uh, there's, a, there's a work ethic in, uh, in, in, in this region, in this part of the country, that is well suited to the kind of work that we do here, which is so important to our allies, so important to our warfighters. Um, but it's also uniquely situated uh, near some great schools uh, that produce the kind of technology know-how that we've relied on in the past and will rely on in the future. One reason for our success has always been an uh, a, a aggressive approach to investing. Uh, we're a technology-driven enterprise, which means uh, we can't wait to hear from our customers on what's needed. We need to be at the forefront of cutting in tech cutting edge technology. So we invest in our technology, but uh, locally, how that manifests itself is uh, an investment in a lot of facilities that are, that are world class, uh, in, uh, certainly in Nashua. You know, we've invested in a very unique, uh, what we call the Jam Lab, which is a capability to make sure that the threats that we're trying to defeat, uh, that, that we can understand those and build the solutions into a system and then test them before they leave. And we have more than one facility of that nature where uh, we have incredible confidence in what we're sending to our warfighters because we've invested in facilities and the people to make sure that, um, that we're putting the best products out there. Uh, and we're also stretching uh, our investment in, in products. We uh, recently acquired a company within the past two years in Manchester that uh, has a very different approach to deploying technology. We tend to deploy requirement-rich technology, lots and lots of investment, bells and whistles, whereas this company takes a much more uh, streamlined approach. And we complement each other very, very well. And in, in so doing, we're finding new ways to deliver the solutions that, that are so important and still drawing on the local, on the local area and the local uh, expertise. There is no getting away from our core capabilities. We are primarily focused on defense technologies, what we do is unique in the world. We're the largest and most important electronic warfare provider in the world. That's not going to change. We're going to be relied upon to do that and deliver it. But to the extent we're able to expand our, our offerings to non-defense customers, that makes the whole enterprise more secure. And that makes our ability to produce those critical technologies all the more secure. We're taking bolder moves than we've ever taken in what we call adjacent markets. When you're in a defense world, that means commercial. And uh, we, have, uh, we have a significant piece of our business, not so much in New Hampshire, but part of the group that's headquartered here, uh, that is purely focused on, on commercial solutions. There are parallels to the technology, but the customers are very different. And we think that's going to make us stronger over the long term. One of the things we're very proud of is we uh, actually do hybrid electric engines for buses, very different than anything else we've done. But again, it provides a little more stability and, and diversity in, in what we do. And then finally, you know, we're, um, you know, it's not a coincidence that so much of our work is concentrated in a good, low overhead, business friendly state like New Hampshire. You know, there's, there's a reason why the business started as Sanders across the border and you know, moved over. And it's because, uh, you know, it needed the freedom uh, to, to grow and prosper. And, and that freedom is still important today. So there's a lot of good reasons why we're we're proud to be here and proud to be working so hard and expect to be prosperous in the future.